Chair, uh, Blade Runner is a classic movie, and this sequence. Holy shit! Look <laughs> at your beard. Did you like it? <laughs> bigger, bigger than mine. Than yeah. I don't know if I stretch mine out though. <laughs> look at this. Look it's at that finger. <laughs> look at that. See mine? It's curls. So if I stretch. Yeah, they, they get bigger. Or equal, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, guys. I don't know, look how long that is. If I stretch it out, we have to have a competition. I want to ask you about Blade Runner, it is a classic movie, and this sequence is one of the most anticipated films of the year. How was work on a great move like that and work with great actors like Harrison Ford or Ryan Gosling? Incredible. Awesome opportunity. I mean, great. I, I can't overstate the pleasure that I had working with Harrison. For me, a, a hero and one of the best. You know, not only Indiana Jones, uh, not only Star Wars, uh, but films like Mosquito Coast, beautiful movie. He's a phenomenal actor, and I really enjoyed my time with him. And we saw some parts of the film today, and Wells is a bad guy or not? I don't think so. Because he sees the future, he knows what it, it's going to take in order to save humanity. Save humanity, creating an army of replicants. But that you say that like it's a bad thing. We're making a mess of things down here on this planet. So uh, I don't know. Maybe, who knows? Maybe replicants could be very helpful. The original movie was in 2019, uh, two years from now. And how far we are from that future, that dystopic future? I do think that it's, it's, that the film touches on on really important issues about technology and humanity in that intersection. And we can talk about artificial intelligence nowadays. Should us be afraid of that? Yeah, Why? probably. If there was an, an artificial intelligence that had uh, enough um, control over resources, probably if you did the math, if we sat here and did the math together, you'd probably have to say, oh, well, people have to go. Once artificial intelligence can shut down a power plant, can re-divert resources in one way in order to make decisions that need to save the planet. Yeah, it's, there are going to be some tough choices that need to be made. Yeah, this is terrifying. So, Jared, thank you. Thanks. Great to see you. See you soon.